see you next Sunday, Sister Mary Beth. Good afternoon, universe. My name is Don Mazzetti. You may know me as international funny man and stay-at-home son. But today, I'm putting the laughs aside so I can talk to you about a very serious affliction that me and many bros suffer from. Small calves. You were discretion advised. This is going to be graphic. <sighs> everywhere suffer needlessly. Their only mistake, being born with small calves. This, this is Gion. He was born in a village much like yours and mine. He goes to the gym, he works out, but his calves, they're starving. And what are you doing about it? Sitting there, doing your curls, doing your bench press, while children like Gion, children of the church of iron, suffer every day. It's gonna be Ooh, oh, who are you, man? I'm just a bro trying to help you out, man. Small calves are the biggest source of male insecurity in the world. <laughs> 27,000 men are diagnosed each year with clinical depression because of their teensy calves. It's not their fault they were born weak sauce. It's genetics. Come on, bro, I'm here for you. All right, bro, we got this. Ah! It's been proven that you can't grow your calves through exercise. Don't tell me to do calf raises. Calf raises are about as good for growing your calves as actually raising calves. Trust me, I've tried both. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Everybody's got their wives' tale about how to get big calves. Jump rope, stretch in between sets, do them every day. Nah, now nah, you're doing them too much. Exercise bike on high resistance, high volume, low weight, low volume, high weight. Go hiking, pull a sled around, steal Blake Griffin's calf muscles. Nothing works. Set, set, set. Yo, can I get a spot over here? The dude giving you this advice is the dude that was born with big calves. What the fuck does he know? He's the guy that comes in here and squeezes in three sets of body weight raises before he leaves the gym. Just leave. We know they're big. Quit rubbing it in. I don't go around eating bagels in front of anorexics or go around doing math in front of retards anymore. But I'm over here saving up for a Civic and you're waxing your bench in front of me. Bro fact! The dudes with the biggest calves never work them. It's like being born white. Uh, I'm making partner my dad's law firm next week. I haven't even started law school yet. Ooh, are you doing a setting or not? The walk up? Want if I work in? Sure. Yeah! Weed in the water, go to Buddha. Question for God. Why are some dudes born with big calves, but no dudes are born with big biceps? Set. Now, if you're like me, you've tried every way to get your calves to grow. So since they're not actually gonna get bigger, here are a few ways to make them look bigger and make you feel better. High socks. When things look shorter, they look fatter. Example, my chub. Tall socks make your legs look shorter, which make your calves look thicker. This is an optical illusion. It also makes you look like you're going to play a cool sport. This is also an optical illusion because you're only here to work out. High socks are the bro equivalent of push-up bras. Titties. Black socks only. You're not a 45 year old rapist dad or Mac Miller. <laughs> Sweet kick! Kill shot! High top shoes! Sometimes the problem isn't that your calves are small, it's that your ankles are tiny. No matter how much you work your calves, it's damn near impossible to grow your ankles. This is what the last three Mission Impossible movies were about. Wearing high top shoes is not only the sickest bro move ever, but it conceals those dainty girl bones you call ankles. Kill Bill! Bonus! Combine high tops with high socks for the ultimate cab deception package. 
pre-pumps. The calf game is a game of inches. Well, not actual inches, because you can measure those. Think more millimeters, uh, but not millimeters either. Uh, more like magic tricks. Pumps are like makeup. They distract from the fact that your calves suck. Work your calves to pump them, not to grow them. You're trying to get everybody to believe this is how your calves actually look, but it's a lie. They don't look like that. Just like the crater face you brought home from the bar last night, at some point, you gotta wake up to reality. Pants. Pants are the last resort, but the best resort. Kind of like the last resort I went to, which was the best resort I've ever been to. Passages Malibu. If you figured out how to wear pants in the gym, you've pretty much figured out how to win in life. You're one step closer to never having to show your calves again. Next step, rocking pants to the beach. Pants are like those baggy tit curtain shirts that girls wear. Everything looks good up top, but down below, nobody needs to know. Small calves are a big problem. But if we work together, we can help rid the world of this tragedy. But Gion and friends like him don't have to the 12th of them. They need you today. So send this video to a friend in need. Together, we can help small calves disappear into pants. Working in on this video?